What is going on guys? Spicy Cork here for another Rocket League video. Let's go. Let's go. You love to see it. We're doing another uh, Nothing to White Fennec video today. Uh, but before we get into that, I just want to remind you I am giving away this uh, Titanium White Sub-Zero once we reach 12,000 subscribers here on the channel. We're like 700 out right now, I think, which is absolutely insane. Maybe we'll hit it by like next Monday or something. Uh, maybe maybe like mid next week would be absolutely sweet. Uh, you guys have been killing it with the uh, you know the support on the channel lately, so thank you for that. All you have to do to get entered to win this white sub zero is leave me a like on this video, drop me a comment with your gamer tag as well as what platform you actually play on, and then subscribe to the channel of course because it helps me reach my goal of the twelve thousand even faster, and you don't miss out on any future content. Uh, so before we get into the uh, actual trades of today, uh, the item shop, the item shop. So I was, I was hoping, I was hoping and praying that this was going to be a thing and it is, it is. So painted mic drops are a thing now, uh, from the item shop only, of course, but they got gray in the item shop today. I like it. I like it. I'm digging it. Uh, don't forget to use my code CORGYT. It was already in there, but like, I'll put it in for you again. Uh, just, you know, because why not? Uh, yeah, don't forget to support me if you do want to. Uh, it does help me out a lot here on the channel. And, you know, this, this is a pretty sick gold explosion, not gonna lie. I really like the mic drop. I might have to hold out for the white one or a black one, maybe. Uh, I, I don't know. I might, I might have to have the gray one. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not totally sold on it yet, but, uh, yeah, if you do want to cop it, be sure to use my code. Uh, you know, that's all I got to say. I forget all the time to, to shout out my own code. So yeah, there it is. My, you know, monthly plug of my code. All right. So we're going to go ahead and hop into some trades right now. Uh, this is episode, uh, 13 trading from nothing to a titanium white Fennec. Enjoy. All right, guys. So the very first trade of the video, we are swapping this guy. So you might recognize the name. He uh, bought some of my halos from me a couple videos back, I believe. Um, and he wanted to swap it for a different color. He wanted to swap the orange for the pink, which I was totally fine with because he offered to go ahead and throw like 40 credits on top, which they, the orange and the pink go for the same price. So that worked out perfect. That's 40 credits profit in our account. Uh, we'll take that all day long. Uh, as you can see, we got a lot of items. So we're going to go on kind of a selling spree, uh, kind of get rid of a lot of this stuff, kind of refresh our inventory. Um, yeah, that's kind of, that's kind of the mission, uh, that I, you know, I set out for, for this episode specifically. I wanted to just get rid of, you know, pretty much everything and just get pure credits. And then I could maybe flip some bigger items, uh, you know, towards, you know, later episodes, uh, which we are getting really, really close. So yeah. So moving on from that trade, uh, this guy right here is just buying our Torah, which we got for 160 credits and he is giving us 150 credits and a non-crate import. So we'll take that all day long. That's about 190 credits in value. So that is insane profit in our account. We'll take it, uh, like I said, all day long, you know, no, no complaints from me there. Uh, right here, we are selling three of our non-crate imports to OnlyFans Matt. Uh, I thought it was a kind of kind of a funny name, uh, but he's giving us 40 credits a piece, which you know it, it is what it is. It's not really fantastic, but it's not horrible either. I just kind of wanted to get rid of him. So 120 credits in our account. We value these at about 30 uh, to 40 when we get them. So 40 credits is always a good deal uh, for selling them, in my opinion. Anyways, some people might tell you to hold out for like 50, but I'll take the 40 credits all day long. Uh, so right here, we are moving on and we are actually selling six of our non-crate rares. He tried to lowball me a little bit. Even in his message, he said 10 credits each. And then he tried to hit me with the five credits each. Uh, but we did end up getting 60 credits for all of our non-crate rares, which we had six of them. So 10 credits a piece, uh, which is fantastic because I believe we bought these for five credits a piece. So, uh, you know, we're, we're doubling our profit. Essentially, it's not a lot of credits, but we still, we still like it. We still like it. You know, what are you guys drinking? I got, uh, I got Dr. Pepper with me tonight, uh, to fuel me. I am editing and filming this on, uh, on Wednesday night and you guys are watching this on Thursday. So yeah, we're, we're out here. We're out here. It's late. It's late. Uh, all right, right here. We are selling one of our golden lanterns for 160 credits. Uh, I believe we got these for like 135 a piece. 140 so either way that's still 20 credits profit in our account uh 
kind of disappointing that he j didn't want all of them, but you know, he, he just wanted one of them. So that's okay. Uh, right here, we are actually getting rid of that black standard that we took a little bit of a risk on. Uh, we ended up buying this for 2,470 credits. And as you can see right here, this guy is giving us 2,600 credits. So 130 credits profit in our account. Um, this was a little bit harder to sell. Uh, it was a little bit of a gamble, but it did pay off a little bit. Uh, you know, 130 credits is, it, it's pretty good. It's not great, but uh, I do think it was worth the, uh, the risk that I took on it. Um, so right here, we are selling just one of our golden lanterns for 160 credits and a non-crate rare, which is essentially 170 credits. So we'll take that all day long. That's pretty good profit for us. Like I said, we bought these for 135 to 140 a piece. So, you know, 160 and an ad, we will take that all day. So right here, we are actually buying a Dissolver. We've sold a lot of stuff. We're looking pretty good uh, credits wise. You know, we got quite a bit stacked up in there and still some pretty good items yet to sell. Uh, so I decided to, uh, I was looking at like the spreadsheets and stuff and Dissolver is super, super strong. I was looking at, you know, uh, people wanting to buy them and it seemed like they were offering even like 2250, 2300. Uh, and I happened to come across this one for 2200 And so I went ahead and picked it up, uh, you know, kind of just on a whim just to see if I could make some profit on it. And if not, I would just, you know, dump it for 50 credits, easy profit. Uh, but it actually ended up working out really, really, really well. Uh, as you can see in this next trade right here, we actually ended up swapping the Dissolver for a Titanium White Interstellar, just one to one. Uh, now the Dissolver is worth, I believe, 2400 credits max value and the titania white interstellar is worth 2600 to 2800 so pretty good profit right there uh like 400 500 credits roughly uh you know depending on what we actually get for the interstellar but we will take that all day long i have no complaints there and so right here, we are actually moving on and immediately selling our white interstellar because uh, I can't seem to get rid of my halos for some reason. Uh, no one is really wanting them. Uh, so we're actually selling this for 1400 credits, two gray standards, a gray zigzag, a crimson chrono, and a non-crate very rare. So 1400 credits, the two gray standards both go for about 650 credits minimum value. They're 650 to 850. So that is 1300 credits. So that's 2700 credits right there. And then basically just some ads. Uh, I didn't get any credit offers above 2550. So I will take that all day just because I know that once I dump these gray standards for even minimum value, I'll still be making profit on it. So I'm totally okay with this trade. Uh, yeah, I, I had no complaints at all. He kept throwing stuff in there and I was like, yeah, let's do it. That's good enough for me. I was a little bit scared because they were gray, but you know, it worked out pretty good. It worked out pretty good. So we're, we should be able to make some pretty insane profit off this stuff. Uh, and you know, just move on with our day. So this is going to lead us into our very last trade of the video, which we are just selling our very last two golden lanterns. Uh, we're selling them for 320 credits, so 160 a piece. Like I said before, uh, we did get these for 140-ish a piece, uh, maybe 135. I don't totally remember exactly what it was, but we will take that all day long. That's huge profit for us uh, in our account. We went on such a selling spree and yeah. All right, guys, that is going to do it for today's video. Uh, we're we're getting close. We're like 10,000 credits, 11,000 credits, something like that. Uh, we're real close. White Fennec is only going for about 13,500 right now, I believe it is. Uh, somewhere around there. I think it's 13 to 14,000. So we're, we're creeping up on it. A couple more episodes. I'm hoping only a couple more episodes. That would be sweet. That would be amazing. Uh, before I let you go, don't forget we are giving away this uh, Titanium White Sub-Zero. Once we reach 12,000 subscribers here on the channel. So all you have to do to get entered to win is drop me a like on this video. Leave me a comment with your gamer tag as well as what platform you play on. And then subscribe to the channel if you do want to and you do want to support me, uh, you know, and stick around for future content. Um, yeah, don't also don't forget. Uh, I always forget to say this. Um, don't forget to use my code in the item shop. Uh, Korg YT. It is just uh, Korg YT just like that. Uh, you don't even have to like capitalize it or anything. Uh, but yeah, they got the gray mic drop in the shop. I mentioned this at the beginning of the video. Uh, it looks, it looks pretty good. I, I'm really excited for the white one to come out.
I think the white one is going to be a must-have. The gray one, I'm not totally sold on, but it does look really, really good. So, yeah. All right, guys, that's going to be it for the video. I will catch you next time. Peace.